Just before 7 this Thursday morning, dozens of kids in Corona lined up waiting for the bus to go to school, some even standing with their parents. But not all of them going to IS-5, about two and a half miles away, got on. The bus has not been coming. We get one bus and the bus takes 20 head count counted students and there's like about 100. Parents like Cristania Rodriguez, whose son suffers from epilepsy, are frustrated, saying it has gotten worse since the start of the school year. You have to come really early, 6.30, stand in line, try not to push or play tug of war. This is cell phone video showing some of the chaos at the Queens bus stop earlier this week. We're told students who don't get on the bus near 38th Avenue and 108th Street are forced to find other ways to get to their middle school. Matthew Velez, who's in the eighth grade, reluctantly takes the train. When the bus never comes, like it mostly like never comes, I usually have to take a train. Some parents were even paying for cabs this morning so their kids could get to class safe and on time. How many kids do you take every morning? Or have you been taking? I count five, six trips. So my fear is, you know, might he get into the wrong car ride? Late Thursday, the Department of Education released this statement to PIX11. Quote, every day we bus 149,000 students on approximately 9,000 routes and work to immediately address any individual concerns families may have. More students who are eligible for bus service are continuing to enroll at IS-5 and we are adding another bus at this stop starting tomorrow morning. End quote. This is our kids and um, we need help. And we were able to talk with that bus company today. They tell us about 35 students usually get picked up in the morning. What they will be doing now is adding a safety officer inside of the bus to ride with the students to see what the problem is and how it can be fixed. We're told that will happen beginning tomorrow morning. In Corona, Queens, Jennifer Bisram, PIX11 News.